Most Apple users just like you are confused on which pair of AirPods is best to buy. Apple makes great headphones and earbuds, but they are a little pricey. So when you get them, you want to make sure that you bought the right ones for yourself. But which ones will be the right ones for you? Hi, if you're new here, I'm Destin Tech and on this channel, I focus mainly on tech reviews, unboxings, and consumer electronic tips to make purchasing easier for you. In this video, I'll be giving you a buyer's guide for each model from the AirPod lineup. This lineup includes the second and third generation AirPods and the AirPod Pros. This video should be able to help you make the best decision on what the best AirPods are for yourself. If you like Apple tech content like this, subscribe so you don't miss any future videos similar to this one. First, the price of these AirPods start at $129 for the second generation, $179 for the third generation, and $249 for the Pros. The designs of all of these AirPods are fairly similar but slightly different. The second generation AirPods have a longer stem than both the third generation and the AirPod Pros. But the Pro model AirPods have the smallest stem compared to all of the others. Unlike the other AirPods, the AirPod Pros come with ear cups for extra comfort and support inside your ear. I can say that generations 2 and 3 can get a little uncomfortable after being in your ears for long periods of time. The ear cups that come with the AirPod Pros also come in multiple sizes so that they fit your ears perfectly. In addition to the ear cups being exclusive for the AirPod Pros, what is also exclusive to them is active noise cancellation and transparency mode, but it also has spatial audio with dynamic head tracking, which is also offered on the third generation AirPods, but not the second generation. If you're unsure what spatial audio is, it is a feature that creates the illusion that the sound you're listening to is following the movement of your head. Apple says that this feature will provide you a more theater-like experience no matter what you're listening to, and using it with the AirPods is pretty cool. All of the AirPods do well sound-wise, I did notice a significant gap between the Generation 2 AirPods compared to the rest when it comes to sound and volume quality. It isn't the worst, but you'll definitely hear a clear difference between them and the rest. I've also noticed that the Generation 3 AirPods and the Pro AirPods do very well with bass levels. If you decide to get either one of these, you'll be satisfied with the amount of bass in each song you listen to. I hope you enjoyed this video of me comparing all of these AirPod models. If you have not seen my other AirPod video, I did do a review on the AirPods Max. So if you like this video, I encourage you to go check that video out as well. Make sure you comment your favorite pair of AirPods if you own or plan to own some. Also, comment any other Apple or tech content you would like to see from me. Thanks for watching to the end. Don't forget to like and subscribe for future tech content like this. You just watched the Destin Tech video and I'll see you in the next video.